So we're here with Daniel, Jack. Um, what'd you guys just get out of? Uh, the linear exam. Yeah, MA two sixty five. Okay. Uh, what do we think on a scale of to ten? How hard was it? Um, yeah, I'd buy that was like a twelve. Twelve. All right. Maybe an eight. Maybe an eight. <laughs> Is there um, any studying resource you guys use to help prepare? Uh, boiler exams. I didn't yeah. go to class, just boiler exams. Okay, okay. Boiler exams and uh, the teacher's practice exams, that was about it. If you had to recommend boiler exams to a friend, do you think you would? Uh, definitely. 100%. Any feedback you have for the creators? Um, around exam time, it gets a little slow because there's a lot of traffic. Okay. Although it is kind of nice that it says the time and date of the exam. Yeah, keep it coming, man. Just just keep all the exams out. Keep the topics, studying stuff up there, everything you can. We just need it. All right, thank you very much. Good luck on the next one. Appreciate you. So what, did you, what exam did you guys just get out of? MA 265. Right. How would you rate on a scale from E to the 0 to 10? 8.5. Think a 7. 7, yeah. 8.5. And did you guys use boiler exams to study for it? Yeah. You did. If you felt like you hadn't used it, would that score be higher for the difficulty of the exam? Yeah. Yeah. What was the number one thing you liked about using the site that made you feel more confident going into the exam? So I liked that, like, when I got, like, a wrong answer when studying, it told me, like, how many other people also selected that answer. So if I got it wrong, but a lot of people also got it wrong, then I didn't feel like that I was, like, too, like, I don't know, like, since a lot of people also got it wrong, I felt, like, more confident that I, like, in my in my choice, even though it was wrong. Exactly. I don't know if it makes, if it makes sense. Yeah. yeah, that's absolutely true. Any other input? I like the videos. Yeah, I like, I like the, the videos. That, that I use that a lot. explains, like, you know, like, the exercises. For me, when doing the practice problems, it's easier to see the answers in boiler exams than looking for them in the, like, answers. Yeah, in the past exam. Yeah, sounds awesome, guys. Really appreciate it. Is, is there any constructive criticism, any feedback you'd like to give to the site? Anything you'd like to see on there? I mean, sometimes, like, it, the site might get, like, super slow and, like, it, the exams won't load. Like, today I was trying to study and I couldn't, like, load up the exams. Like, I could load up, like, some of the questions, like, by topic, but not the exams for some reason. And it has happened, like, two or three times before. So, other than that, I think it's, it's, it's great. Yeah. Any other feedback? Great. One final question. What's your favorite color? Blue. Blue? Pink. Pink? Green. Green? What's your favorite color? Red. Red. All right. Well, wide variety of responses here. Thank you guys so much. It was super you. awesome. So I'm here with Joe and Lewis. What test did you guys just get out of? Linear Algebra MA265. Same test. What did you guys think of the test? It was a really, really hard. Yeah, it was. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. On a scale of 10 to 10, what would you give it? I'd probably give it like a 8, maybe. It was a lot different than the previous years. Oh, yeah, okay. Crater's like... Yeah, Crater's like business, business school. Yeah. Um, I, I'd also give it like, like an 8. It was just very tricky. Is there any studying resource you use to study? We did use boiler exam. Uh, yeah, boiler exams for videos, and then I used the exam archive for the PDFs of the tests. What do you guys think about boiler exams? I'm a big fan. It's, it's, it's helpful to have explanations on the ones you get wrong. Yeah, I'd say the, the explanations are definitely helpful, especially when you're just like fully lost on a question. Do you have any feedback you'd like to give the creators? Some of the explanations can be a little bit uh, long, I would say. Like, at the end of one explanation of a problem, you'll just see ink all over a question, and it's not spaced out very well. And then it's just like, what did I just watch? So, like, organization after the, like, doing, like, a chronological flow is important, you think? Yeah. I do like how, like, Liam Robinson does it where he, like, scrolls to the bottom and writes out all the work instead of just doing it on the problem and you can't read it. You like Liam's style? Is there anyone else, any other, um, like, course or person on Boiler Exam's content that you've liked? I don't know anyone else's names. Okay. Any, well, any, like, courses? I don't know. I, I mainly use it for math. Okay. Yeah. I, I think chem's pretty strong as well. Uh, it's not on, like, exam-wise, but uh, we do get the... Uh, That's you? Hey, thank That's you, man. Thank M115. you. M115. I, I got you. You carried my... Last me. semester, you were the guy. But it was all, like, FRQ-based, right? Uh, yeah. Last semester? It, it, it was. was. 
Uh, there, there's a couple bad. multiple choice. The multiple choices were the easy ones, I think. Okay. All right, that's good For enough. Kim, at least. All right. Um, well, anyways, good. Oh, final question. Favorite animal? Zebra. Going with giraffe every day. Well, best of luck to you guys in future exams. Thank you for using boiler exams. This one right here. So, we're here with Donnie. Savvy. What exam did you guys just get out of? We just took our MA265 exam number two. What do we think about it? General mm -hmm. opinions? Meh, like 50-50. I, I thought it was pretty good. 50-50. What was the hardest topic on it? Uh, ooh, what would you say? I'd say the conceptual question that related to subspaces. Yeah. yeah, I said the conceptual questions as well. Yeah. Was there any studying resource you guys used in particular? Uh, I used the uh, boiler exams online for this exam in particular. It gave three practice ones that I used, and it really helped improve my knowledge and prepared me for some questions on this exam. Yeah, boiler exams. Uh, Do you think this sped up the rate it took you to study? I think it did because it gives good examples of problems that you'd see on the exam because it used past exams and they're all pretty similar in what they use. So it's getting that experience really helps. Yeah, 100%. Because like, when they work through actual exam problems, it really helps to see that. Would you? Final question. Would you recommend it to a friend? Uh, I sure would. Yeah. Thank you so much.